Can I apply for USA citizenship if I am a victim of a crime? Yes, as a victim of a crime, you may still be eligible to apply for you. Citizenship However, it is important to note that being a victim of a crime does not automatically grant you citizenship. To become a U. Citizen, you would need to meet the general requirements set by the U. Citizenship and Immigration Services, USCIS. Here is a general overview of the U.S. visa process and immigration guidance. 1. Determine your eligibility Visit the USCIS website to determine if you meet the eligibility requirements for a U.S. visa or citizenship. Choose the appropriate visa category. There are different types of visas available, such as immigrant visas for permanent residency and non-immigrant visas for temporary stay. Choose the visa category that best suits your situation. File a petition. Depending on the visa category, you may need to have a sponsor or employer file a petition on your behalf. For family-based visas, AU. Citizen or permanent resident family member may need to file a petition for you. For wait for visa availability, some visa categories have limited numbers of visas available each year, so you may need to wait for a visa to become available. 5. Complete the application Once your petition is approved, you will need to complete the appropriate visa application forms and submit supporting documents. Attend an interview You may be required to attend an interview at AU. Embassy or consulate in your home country. During the interview, you will be asked questions about your background and purpose of travel. Undergo medical and background checks. As part of the process, you will need to undergo medical examinations and background checks to ensure you meet the health and character requirements. 8. Receive a decision. After completing the necessary steps, the USCIS will review your application and make a decision on whether to grant you a visa or immigration status. It is important to note that the U. Immigration process can be complex and may vary depending on your individual circumstances. It is recommended to consult an immigration attorney or seek professional guidance to ensure you understand the specific requirements and procedures relevant to your situation. Thanks for watching. Please like and share this video. Also hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and let's embark on a journey of knowledge together.